a New York City correction officer was a raid Friday afternoon. He was charged with murdering an 18-year-old in the Bronx while off duty. 18-year-old Raymond Charles Saint was shot and killed around 1.30 a.m. On a Thursday, they found him with a gunshot wound to his face in the passenger side of a vehicle at Grand Concourse in East Tremont. His mother spoke with him an hour before the incident and said the last thing he said to her, I love you, Mom. Sources say Charlie Saint and his friends may have been shooting off jail pellets out of what's called an Orbeez gun in the area of the Cross Bronx Expressway and Morris Avenue. The off-duty correction officer was allegedly struck in the back and didn't know what hit him and returned fire in the direction that he thought the assault was coming from. 45-year-old Dion Middleton, who worked as a firearms instructor, allegedly never reported what happened and went to work. The Department of Correction, Commissioner Louis Molina, released a statement saying, These very serious charges are in no way a reflection of the officers who work to keep our city safe every day. This officer will be immediately suspended without pay, and if the charges are true, he will face the full consequences of the law and be terminated. And in another statement, the Correction Officers Benevolent Association offered condolences to the family, but said in part, our officer fired a single shot in a situation where he felt his life was in immediate danger, particularly after feeling something hit his back. We are aware that the NYPD traffic agent had also reported being hit with pellets in the same vicinity an hour beforehand. Friends and families gathered outside of Chelsea Saint's apartment building Friday. They say he loved his family and was an uncle. He died on his nephew's birthday, his sister said. He always was about his friends and always about love. He was always about showing people love, said his girlfriend Julian. Said he wasn't a street person or none of that. He took care of his family and he was a likable guy. Everybody liked him. Police say there has been several recent incidents locally and nationally linked to a TikTok challenge where people post videos of themselves shooting at random people with jail guns. In some instances, others have shot back with real bullets. Charlotte Saint's family and friends insist that's not what happened here. He wasn't involved with that. The New York Police Department tweeted a warning about bead blasters that shoot jail water beads propelled by a spring-loaded air pump, making them an air rifle. Air rifles are a violation in New York City and are unlawful to possess. Violators found in possession of these will be issued a criminal summon and the weapon will be confiscated. Middleton remains in jail until further notice. Stay tuned here at Prime Crime Network as we keep you posted. I know, yeah, my friends, don't forget to hit that like button and that subscribe button. And don't ever forget to leave a comment as we value your opinion right here at Prime Crime Network. Police say 18-year-old Raymond Chalouisant was shot and killed Thursday morning around 1.30. They found him with a gunshot wound to the face in the passenger seat of this car at Grand Concourse in East Tremont. His shocked mother spoke to him an hour before and shares the last thing he said to her. I love you, Mom. Police sources say Chalouisant and friends may have been shooting off gel pellets out of what's called an Orbeez gun in the area of the Cross Bronx Expressway and Morris Avenue. An off-duty correction officer, they say, was allegedly struck in the back and, not knowing what hit him, returned fire. That officer, 45-year-old Dion Middleton, is now charged with murder, manslaughter. Middleton works as a firearms instructor, allegedly never reported what happened and went to work. The Department of Corrections says this officer will be immediately suspended without pay, and if the charges are true, he will face the full consequences of the law and be terminated. Justice for Raymond! Friends and family gathered outside Raymond's apartment building Friday. They say he loved his family and was an uncle. He died on my son's birthday. He was with his friends. He was always about his friends, always about love, always about showing people love. Police say there have been several recent incidents locally and nationally linked to a TikTok challenge where people with these gel guns shoot at random people and post it. Raymond's family and friends insist that's not what this was. Because he wasn't involved with that. 
The NYPD tweeted this warning about bead blasters that shoot gel water beads propelled by a spring-loaded air pump, making them an air rifle. Air rifles are a violation in New York City and are unlawful to possess. He was going. It would never be another one of him. I'm so sorry. I mean, 18-year-old for murder, for water.